Sorry about this, Stacey. We're just waiting on this other actor. He should be here shortly. Oh, no. Ah, sorry I'm late. Hey, got on the rang bus. Ended up in the middle of anywhere. <laughs> it's not a problem, right? Well, you know we're dubbing the voices for uh, Look Who's Sucking 3. Stacey, you're the horny housewife. Ronald, you're the plumber. Oh, Stacey. <laughs> um, look, who's, uh, look who's sucking 3. Never, never heard of that. No, well, you wouldn't have. It was made in Italy, mate. All oh, right, Italian film, that's, that's good, isn't it? Italian films are good. Everybody happy? Yeah. I knew it was you, Fredo. You what? I knew it was you, Fredo, Godfather. <laughs> that's an Italian film. Yeah, Italians. yeah. Yeah, it was. Good. Now, if you look at the tape, you'll see that the dialogue is minimal. Right. So don't worry too much about lip syncing, all right? right? Just do the best you can. Let's sit next to you. And roll tape. Right. That's me with a moustache. I'm the plumber. Hi, handsome. I'm here to fix your plums, your, 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 your sink. So you like to fix things, do you? Yeah, that's my chest you're touching. That's my chest there. That's, that's, that's my chest for I'm only just in the door there. You want to come upstairs? Is that where your, is that where your sink is? Uh, no, what? Well, come on now, I'm a busy plumber. I'm going to be stunned about your all day. Stop the tape, stop the tape, stop the tape. Ronald, Ronald, mate. There's no sink in this movie. There's plumber in the sink, how's that? Well, you come to the door, you open the door, you go in, little bit of chat, right, as your father upstairs to get it on. Right. Get what on? Pumping! Right. Right. Roll tape. Hello again, it's, it's me, the plumber, from before. Hi, handsome. You like to fix things, don't you? That's right, I do. I like to fix things except sinks. I don't do sinks. <laughs> Why don't you come upstairs and fix me? How? What's wrong with you? I'm hot. You want me to open a window? And we fade down. Fade up into the bedroom. I've made sure. Oh, no. That's me, oh, God. She's kissing your chest. She's moving down to your mm. waist. That's... She's mm. going down now, even further. I can... Oh, you're so big. Jeez, I, I'm not enough. That's a <laughs> that's, that's, that's horrible. But you, but... Mm, that's fix a, me, baby. That's a, an awful yeah. kiss. Come on, oh, my, yes. Can I let my sister know oh. I'm doing this kind of stuff? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Sexy yes. Oh, that's... Yeah. that's Oh, that must yes. be helping you. That's a hell of a size. Oh, no, no. Yes. Sexy. Sexy. Yes. Sexy. Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. yes. 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 Oh, yes. Yes. That's it. That, right. That's it. Yeah, but That's it. Yes. Right. I'm the plumber. Yeah, yeah, Look at you. Right. Look at that. Big breathing. Yeah, I'm the plumber. Yes. Sexy. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. That's you. Yeah. Oh. That's it. You. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wait. 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 <laughs> you missed a bit. Come here, Ronald, will you? Hold that for me. What's this? <laughs> help! Help! There's been a terrible accident! Brenda, you bastard! <laughs> You get it. You get it, Dad. I don't like getting it. Go on. Hello. Thank you for... Yeah, thank you for returning my call. I'd like to make an appointment. My usual dentist is uh, Mr. Simpson. <laughs> yes, specialist, yes. Yes, I see. See. Yes, six o'clock. Yes, thanks. 
Thanks. <laughs> Happy? And it left me with a scar. The exact shape of a cross. Right there. Go on. Touch it. <laughs> <laughs> Go and know day that. Oh, just go and know. There you are. That's a ninety-nine and a bottle of iron brew. You should be pal wanting. He's wanting a scratch your fanny. <laughs> 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 Vala o Elsa Knogel. Elsa Knogel. But. Vala tela splashy popa popa ustibata. Vala sha package. Vala sha isha. Vala sha isha package. Vala sha isha. Hush. Hush. She'll have both a cannabis raisin. Hola, he's a Hola, Polis? Hola, he's a Fona Polis. Hola, he's a Fona Tatum. Vir Gulash. Gosh, oh. Rizla! Rizla! Hola! James, you'll never believe what's coming. Oh, the Great Western Road, original film footage from 1921, a Gleska's swankiest boulevard. Oh, imagine the delights of the banter, frozen in celluloid. Oh, absolutely. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, we can't go. Has it been and went? No, but the picture house is in Edinburgh. Oh, <laughs> yuck. Edina, Scotia's midden seat. Capital in name only. One great big dirty wet blanket of a place full of Tacky rock shops and saunas punting hondrily. Ah, those Edinburghians are all though an aloof and superior way. No half as friendly as your Glesky Keeley. Oh, they're absolute head the balls. <laughs> so we'll not be travelling through there. Indeed we will not be going through there, Gary. As the banter puts it, you'll have mere fun at a Glesky stabbing than an Edinburgh wedding. Too true, James. Too true. Hi there, welcome to Tan Fasty Island, your one-stop bronzing shop. How can I help you? Me and my boyfriend are going on holiday today after the morning. You don't want to end up lying in the beach looking like a milk bottle. You'll be after your one-off hyper tube. Uh, 30 seconds in, out, and that'll be you done. Right, there's a towel. Okay. So where is it you're off to? Ibiza, two weeks. Ibiza's magic. Do you know the word diarrhoea is exactly the same over there? <laughs> On the end, <laughs> <laughs> Right, on. We've our tablets and my tea bag still to get.
This harness is a bit shiggly. Gonna have to get the man. Here, this is the longest roller coaster in Europe. Harry. All right enough, George. I didn't realise that. Harry. I thought the one in Disneyland would have been a lot longer than this. No, no, the one in Disneyland has got one less, um... Harry! God's sake, hold on a minute, George. What is it, Linda? I'm just saying this harness is loose. Rubbish. Give yourself peace. Carry on, George. No, I'm just saying the one in Disneyland's got one less twist and it's about 30 feet shorter. Woohoo! Harry! I don't know, interrupt us. Can you not see we're trying to have a conversation? What is it? Saying this harness is the foot right of seatbelt, whatever you call it. Restraint! Well, whatever you call it, does it fit right? That's right, George, isn't it? The restraint is called. Yes, Harry, they call it a restraint. Don't worry, Linda. They're designed to fit pretty much most, you know, people. Does it feel right? Linda, don't interrupt George when he's trying to put your mind at rest. Carry on, George. I'm just saying, Linda, it's got to be leeway for fat kids and dull folk. Don't worry, they're designed to fit most people. You hear that, Linda? Designed to fit most people. But then again, you have most people. You're that wee bit special. 8,000 people like this roller coaster every day. And you have to be the only one that is straight this big back. Look at yourself, drawing yourself through hey, throwing your hands up, having a good time. Hey, this thing was built by computer, taking into consideration speed, inertia, central fugal fusion. And that's not good enough for you. No, no. Get the man. Get the man. This thing is sugary. This is sugary. Here, get the man. Get the man. Isn't any of that mad ping pong pattern, by the way? No, nah, man, your ping pong was pinging all over the shop there. No chance of your gold, you know what I mean? Fancy a go at the shooting bit. <laughs> Hit the target and win a prize. Up you come now. One shot wins the prize. Come on up. <laughs> Aye, man. Aye, man. <laughs> Quality, oh, man. man. Uh, crossbow. <laughs> That's absolutely <laughs> tops, man. Beautiful. <laughs> He's a gonk, you dopper. <laughs> Laura, what time is it? It's two minutes to nine, Dad. Two minutes to nine. Where are the bookings? There should be a queue. You see, in the old days, there was always a queue. Van driver, lorry driver, taxi driver, police. You had all your money in detail by lunchtime. Dad, calm down. You're not running a barber shop now. This is a salon. Salons are different. Different, Hoggies, peace. <laughs> oh, thank God, a customer. Hello, dear sweetheart. Would you like a wee cup of tea or a wee cup of coffee? Maybe have a wee squint at the auto trader, eh? Dad! <laughs> Hi there. Nine o'clock, was it? Yeah, that's right. Come and get a seat. That's great. Okay. So, it looks like it's So, is this a wee day off for you? <laughs> no, I don't work. Doesn't it work, eh? How's you gonna pay for a haircut? Good. So, are uh, you going away any nice holiday this year? No. Dad. Why don't you go and keep an eye on the front of the shop, OK? And if anybody phones, I'll take the booking. On you go. I'm sorry about that. It's a bit nervous today. It's our first day open. That's <laughs> all right. So what kind of look is it that you're after? Well, I want a more striking look at the front. You know, something choppy, a bit chunky, but a bit funky too. Mm. Laura, there's some plummy voice woman on the phone wanting to make some booking. <laughs> no problem. Hold, hold on. So, you want a wee bit shorter at the front? Something along those lines, yeah. Right. <laughs> Jesus, Dad! OK, that's 425 for the haircut and uh, Johnny bag for the weekend. <laughs>
Now, Betty, the paper's doing a piece on a century of education. How do you remember your school days? Well, you see, when I was at the school, a lot of folk used to leave when they were 14, but I, I stayed on till I was 16 to further my, um, my uh, thing I had gone with the Janny. <laughs> my bell rung all right. <laughs> my, my mother used to say to me, how do you get your knickers so dirty? I said, like that. But the only place to Janie and I could get a jump was in the boiler room, half of the pool. Uh, what were your teachers like? Did they give you much encouragement? No. Not even when I wore tight blouses in the summer. <laughs> Field English and history and science and maths, but, uh, but the Janie gave me an A-plus for mastering my six and nine pins. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, Away from the classroom, did the pupils smoke a lot in those days? Well, I used to smoke after I'd had a plunder, so... <laughs> I was only about ten a day. <laughs> Happiest days of your life, they say, and that was true, son. The fag hanging out of one end, and the janny hanging out another. <laughs> Do you have any recollections, Betty, that don't involve sex? Oh, I... I um... No. <laughs> Tonight at nine, from the pen of Peter McDuncan. Oh! <laughs> all right, Tinker. Aye, all right, Tom Seymour. Here, do you want to go up with that clarty anus for Lum Nazum? Aye, Tinker, man, no danger! <laughs> you're an orange bastard, and you're a Fenian bastard. That's you, snake-up now, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a gadget that will ride in a switch, King. <laughs> oh, look at him. He's that thin in the face, one eye would deal. Right enough, Tinker. <laughs> 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 Hard lives, hard city, hard men. Don't say! Don't say! Tonight at nine, just another Elephant Boys Graveyard Saturday game. Hey, are you gay? 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 If you're attracted to any of these out-of-work straight actors posing as gay stereotypes, you might be. Call 0891 Night Chuck. Go on, give your knob a bruising while your wife is snoozing. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, fond memories, yeah. I mean, I remember the night I played here. Five curtain calls I took. I mean, they used to say about Glasgow, it's a comedian's graveyard, you know. They all died here. Monkhouse, Clifton, the Winters, Dodd. I mean, if they hated you, they really hated you. But me, well, they loved me. I survived, you know. Not, not many did, but... Cheeky. <laughs> Cheeky Chappy Charlie. Aye. Aye, aye. Cheeky Chinky Chunky, what was it? Aye. Cheeky Charlie Gifford. No. 
close. No, you're not right there, sir. No, 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 no that, that, that's me name. Oh, here I am, uh, right enough. How are you uh, doing? Uh, aye, aye. Jeez, oh, that must have been 40 odd years ago. Aye. Oh, yeah. Aye. Gents, uh, we're doing a thing for the BBC. Aye. Music Hall of Fame. Mr. Gifford performed here. Aye, aye, we know, son, we know. We were here. We came to see oh, him. Oh, really? Aye. Really? Aye. Well, would you mind if we filmed you? Why are I not? I'm okay with you. Come on. Oh, there you come, mate. Right. 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 Come on, right. step, all right? All right. Okay, Charlie, you were saying about your cotton calls. Oh, yeah, yeah. Five curtain calls I took here. I remember it very well. What, 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 what's a curtain call? Cut. It's, it's at the end. Will you take a bow? OK? OK. Rolling? Aye, but he never made it to the end, son. Aye, because he was pissed, sure. <laughs> uh, I beg your pardon. Aye, you were rubbish, son. Aye, uh, you got bottled off. That's how you got that scar on the nose there. That's right. You know, mind Jack, that was me with a screw tab, you know? Yeah. She's a key, Charlie Gifford, the boy from Camden Town. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, fellas, I think you got me mixed up with someone else. No, 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 no. He died in his arse and we witnessed it. That's aye. right, because uh, Jimmy Logan came out and he wiped the flare with him, you know. Aye, aye. Sausages aye. are the boy. Well, hold up, hold up. No, you hold up. Aye, here. Aye, it was roaring and greeting like a aye. big Jesse. It was in the citizen the next day. So That's right aye. enough, Jack, aye. asshole. Aye. Aye. Scotch aye. Is that what you want? You want a piece of me? Aye. Aye. You want a piece of me? <laughs> <laughs> Now, the important thing is, is not to look at each dog for too long. Right. And they'll break your heart, you see. Well, hope you find one. Thanks. Summertime. <laughs> and then live in the sea. Fish are jumping. I'm in a bad way, 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 I'm in a bad way. This is me ma mess. They just put me in here this morning. I'm not like that. I'm house trained. I had a bad bone. Oh, oh here, what up, what up? Oh, oh. Make a card now. Just pick a card, any card you want there. I wouldn't bite your kids, I'm not a bite it. Come on, pick a card. Keep you entertained. Oh, get it up, yeah! Ya cow! <laughs> there was high drama at Kirkcaldy Sheriff Court today as Joseph Gallagher of the notorious Gallagher family was sentenced. 16-year-old Gallagher denied all charges but one, admitting to panning in the video shop Wendy in order to procure the film Pigs in Knickers 4. In light of Gallagher's age, Judge Archibald Sine was forced to pass down a sentence of 80 hours community service. The verdict was greeted with jeers from the gallery, in response to which Gallagher's mother became aggressive and punched the courtroom artist. The job of acting sketch artist was taken up by PC Jock McCulloch of Leaving Division. Glenda Gallagher then made a provocative gesture by standing on the defense table and beckoning towards the gallery, Moan then. <laughs> The presiding judge Archibald Syme appealed for a calm and competent sketch artist to be in place tomorrow when the case against Mrs Gallagher will start. Jeremy Black, Kirkcaldy Sheriff Court. Uh, excuse me, could you give me a change of a pound, please? Yes, I could, sir. Is it for the bus? Aye. You're off into the town, then? Uh, aye, that's right. Aye. See, that's a leafy. Eh? Big day out in the town. Or the shops and the people and the... The bright lights and the, and the people. I am uh, needing a new anorak. Anorak? That's lovely. See, I, I don't really get the chance to go into the town much, you know. I'm kind of stuck in here all the time, day, day after day after day. Look, I'm sorry, I don't mean to be rude, but um, could you give me my change, please? Because my bus is due. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Thanks. Stay here and be my pal, please. <laughs> no money for the bus now. You'd have been as well just staying here with me. I can make you an anorak. A double decker wrappers. Quang. 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 Speed. 
speed in the storm! Oh, tarnation! Hoist the scrot net! I can't eat. It's caught on a crusty bum cleft! If we hoist it, we risk straining the bobby shaft and ripping the panty mesh! Aye, and losing our flexible shoulders of panty markle! That's us! We should make for sure with our halls of deep sea knobbers and striped randy cliffs! Very well! Hold firm the booby shaft and drop the panty mesh! Panty mesh ankled, sir! Right! Now turn around, spot point, and set course for Warham Jism Channel! Head for home! Aye, aye, sir! <laughs> If you're going to break a heart, oh. be sure to break a fat girl's heart, dear bigger, much bigger. If you're going to ruin someone's life, be sure they're not a scale. Skinny girls are fine, but when you dump them, they just run and find another. But when you crush a chubby's heart, she remains with all the fatties on the shelf. That shelf is creaking. She remains with all the fatties on the shelf. <laughs> you think about this morning, eh? Half an hour late. We need to follow mince. I know, man. Sorry. Oh, big mincey head, man. <laughs> big, mad, huge mincey head, man. Mince onions and gravy spot out your head. Big, huge mincey head, man. Full of crazy mince, man. Big minced up coo, man. Totally moon in your head, man. Moo, moo. You've taken that too far. <laughs>